The situation in Afghanistan hits close to home for a local woman with family in that country. She's made her life's work about serving refugee children here in Kansas City. KSHB 41 News reporter Emma James has her message to the community. The chaos in Kabul is personal and heartbreaking for Overland Park resident Maria Goodbreak, whose family fled Afghanistan in 1981. The gunshots and screams are difficult for Maria Goodbreak to process. And just sitting there helpless as the international community is watching one of the greatest stains in American history unfolding right now. And in some ways, and I hate to say this, we're watching evil prevail. Goodbreak's parents fled Afghanistan during the Soviet invasion. She was born in Iran and moved to Kansas City eight years ago. Her nonprofit, Global FC, serves refugee and immigrant youth. She expects an increase in Afghan refugees to Kansas City soon. After the Taliban took control, her biggest worry is about the progress and advancement for women and young girls over the last 20 years. Hope was passed down to these young girls that they can go to school, that they can become something one day, that they can just have the basic human rights, and that is right now being stripped away from them. She wants the men and women who served in Afghanistan to know their work wasn't in vain. I think that their presence and their sacrifices stirred the hearts of Afghan people, that they saw a difference, they saw a taste of democracy, and I think that there are going to be Afghans who are going to rise up and fight to hold on to that democracy. She hopes people understand this isn't the end of the story of Afghanistan. Afghanistan has fallen today, but I don't believe that Afghanistan has fallen. In Overland Park, Emma James, KSHB 41 News.